Hey guys, welcome back to the first video review of this year. In this review, we are going to be taking a look at the Vantech Nexstar TX NST-21052-BK. Now, this is a 2.5 inch external hard drive enclosure. Now, this will be useful for someone who wants to put a 2.5 inch drive, which I'll show you such as my old Seagull Momentus 5400-2 which is a 120 gig which I originally had on my laptop so I would definitely recommend checking this out and let's get to the unboxing alright now let's get started off with the outside of the box some of the features that are listed is aluminum case USB 2.0 plug plug and play compact design it supports 9.5 and 12.5 millimeter thick drives and it also has support for hard drives and SSDs and you can this has a picture on what the the um, enclosure looks like going over the specifications now it supports both SATA 1 and 2 the device size 2.5 inch which basically is 9.5 and 12.5 millimeter in height the serial interface for the internal is SATA, external interface is USB 2.0, the hard drive capacity is up to a 1 terabyte drive, and the material is made out of aluminum, and the dimension is 128 by 78 by 16 millimeters. The package includes the enclosure itself, a USB Y cable, user's manual, installation screws, and a carrying pouch. Now let's get opening this, and it is completely wrapped in plastic. Now open it and make sure you don't cut too deep because you can end up damaging the product inside the box. Now just rip the plastic right off. Alright, uh, the packaging inside the box is cardboard, which is very eco-friendly. Bend it back a little bit. Alright, here is the hard drive enclosure itself. Now let's take a look at the accessories of the drive. You get the USB Y cable. Whoops, sorry about that. I was a little bit outside. This is the USB Y cable, one that will provide power for the hard drive and also for data transfer. You get this little plastic thingy, wherever it's for. A screwdriver inside to install the hard drive. Three, three screws. Again, silica gel, do not swallow. The carrying case, which is made out of a genuine leather by the feels of it. And the user's manual look at this hard drive now. The material of it is made out of aluminum. The Vantag logo is on the top left hand corner and the Nexstar TX logo on the middle right. Now the material of this enclosure is made out of aluminum and has a matte black finish and will also act as a heat sink for the hard drive to keep it cool. There are two screws on each side Right here is the hard drive activity LED and your mini USB port which the hard drive USB cable would be put in. Let's go ahead and tear this apart real quick so I can show you the inside. All you need to do is remove the four screws with the included screwdriver. And by the way these screws are really tiny so you might want to put them on something like the plastic that was included. Oh, looks like we have a missing screw. Hmm. Two missing screws. Alright. So, there's basically two screws. So, scratch the four screw thing. Once I get them all off, all should be good. Alright. Now, just simply take that off and also take the U interface off so basically 
The hard drive would be plugged in uh, here. Now I'm going to show you how to install the hard drive into the hard drive enclosure. Now basically you take this, plug it into the hard drive like you would basically with a laptop almost. Then you want to put this back into the enclosure like so and get put this end in as well. And, it also, and this end also has pen to help use for anti-vibration properties. Then you basically stick this back in, if I can get it back in here. Then after that, you would just put the screws in and you're basically all good. Now I really like this enclosure a lot, seeing that it has a nice durable construction, has USB 2.0, has a activity LED and just plain looks simple and nice. Matte black finish and good stuff. Now, I did a little bit of testing and I was actually able to get about for about 30 megabytes per second which is actually considerably good for USB 2.0. But that's because the hard drive is at for a SATA 2, 6, 3 gigabit per second connection so the limiting factor is the USB so you can't get the full speed off the hard drive. Now, it also does a pretty good job keeping the heat off and so basically um if you have cold hands and you want to warm them up when this gets nice and warm this will make a very nice hand warmer but anyway I don't have a scoring set up yet for hard drive enclosure so I'm just going to do like a percentage recommender or something like that and I would definitely give this a 100 percent recommendation so the only concern is that does take up two USB ports so if you're basically using a laptop then it's going to be a little bit of an issue especially if you have different devices that need to be plugged in at once but that's where a USB hub would definitely come in now another thing I would have liked to see is a actual power port so you can plug like a 5 volt adapter in but yeah, it's still a good drive, but for 8 bucks on Newegg, at the time of this video, prices are always due for change. I would definitely check this out if you are looking for a laptop drive enclosure for 2.5 inch drives and it has a lot of support for a different size, for basically different sizes of, of um, hard drives. But anyway, I would, again, I would highly recommend this hard drive enclosure. And, yeah. Anyway, if you have any questions about this product, feel free to email me at scullabus at gmail.com. Thank you for watching, and you have a good day.